The 2010 World Cup was a heartwarming family affair. There were fathers and sons, father-in-laws and son-in-laws and brothers everywhere. Paraguay had the Barreto brothers, the Torres played for Ivory Coast and Honduras took three Palacios brothers, but then it is a very small country. But the most shocking of all the World Cup siblings were Kevin Prince Botang and his half-brother Jerome, who made competition history when they lined up for the Germany versus Ghana game on opposite sides. Poor. Growing up with a brother who's called Prince and you're just called Jerome, you know, that's going to be hard to deal with to start off with, isn't it? I've played football against my sister in the back garden and it gets pretty nasty. It really does. So, and that's quite a big game in my opinion, but the World Cup is nothing bigger. As if this sibling rivalry wasn't enough, the two brothers hadn't spoken since the Ghanaian Botang had injured the German talisman Michael Ballack nearly two months earlier. To add insult to injury, it was Kevin Prince Bertang who was involved with the injury to Michael Ballack in the Premier League, which ruled the Germany captain out of the World Cup. What did his brother say about that? I wonder if he got a phone call that night and go, what the f are you doing? Well, look, man, it's just, you know, I couldn't play for Germany, and if I can't play for Germany, no one's playing for Germany. So it's lucky I didn't take you out as well, so shut your face, because I'm off training with Ghana. The whole German nation are like, oh, they didn't like Boateng, but they did like Boateng. So they were kind of, for those fans who were sort of shouting, I love Boateng, they were like, which one? Which, which one do you like? Because one of them's ruined our chances, yeah? The two brothers studiously ignored each other throughout the 90 minutes, but it was Jerome who won their Who Plays for the Best Country competition when Germany won the match and went all the way to the semi-finals.